So we're standing with Tyler Gothier, uh, who got third place today at Bear Paw for yeah. the 2012 uh, War Series. Congratulations. Um, tell us about your uh, how you got to third. Well, we went out, uh, Cole hit the, the first hill pretty hard. I was actually happy to see that. I didn't want to be the one to push it hard, but um, when I saw someone else go, I was more than happy to jump on it and go. So Cole and, um, let's see, Mikey Phillips had uh, jumped on a lead. It took me a little bit to roll it back in. They were really kind of flowing through the single track really well. They had so much good skill. And then uh, finally caught back up to them, got to Mikey. And then at, by the end of lap one, we and, um, me and Cole were together. And we just kind of worked and then I thought I had second round. Actually, I knew I was going to battle for first, but coming through the last lap, Cole was just too smooth. And I was, sure. if it wasn't for my full suspension, I wasn't even going to be able to stay with him that long. And I was just able to kind of kind of flow where I wanted to with my full suspension. And then Nathan came roaring up like a vet behind me. <laughs> and I knew it was over from then because once he gets, once he gets going, you know, he's just a trail ninja in there and he just <laughs> goes. And so I felt him coming up and I was just happy to kind of hang on. I, you know, I try to, pulled his wheel but just couldn't do it and settled in for third but I'm happy with that you know I, I needed to come here and get some results sure to kind of wrap up the series and um, so I'm really happy to get third place points today it's, it's a good time to do it you know people are starting their cross season and you know so the the, the competition is you know I don't want to say it's uh, less competitive but um, some of the some of the other big guys aren't here so right it's a, it's a good yeah. place to uh, make up some of your points yeah, it's a good place to get points. You know, we can only race who shows up. I've always said that. You know, it doesn't matter who shows up. Who shows up, you still got to race. You still got to put in an effort. And, you know, the guys that are still here are, you know, just as respectable as anybody else sure. that can come to this series. And we still got to battle hard. But, you know, it made it nice. I, I know that because of the attendance is down a little bit, it is an opportunity to get those last couple points to maybe jump up a spot or two. And that's what I'm looking to do. I'm looking to take that fifth spot and go to fourth or third with sure. it. So. Yeah, that's the only that's the only reason I'm wearing a medal right now. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so you know this uh, this race has kind of come to come to be known as the uh, as a muddy race or a wet race because in the past years it's been that. Yeah. So uh, was this a, a pleasant surprise for you? Or were you expecting yeah. mud? Or well, what? I think last year I, I I tell you what, I stood right over there last year. I didn't think I was going to make it to the vehicle because I was so covered in mud. It was so cold. I think if you go back and look at my interview from last year, I might have been shaking. <laughs> <laughs> when it when it went down so yeah this was a this was beautiful I left this morning from the upper peninsula and as you kind of come down the colors just got better and better sure. it, it's just a gorgeous day for this although I think the track suffered a little bit from last year you know we rutted it out a little bit um, it was really dry the dust kind of started coming up a little bit but it, no it was set up really well I was happy with it it was a pleasant surprise and I'll race in this weather any day oh yeah hey, if you can get this late in the season and still have Upper 60s, lower oh, this 70s. Is, this is tough to it's beat. Perfect. This so, is tough to beat. So congratulations yeah. on your uh, on your finish today, Thank and you. we'll see you at the next race. Yeah.